burn it in. And the music is from the Penthouse Playboys, and they're in Chicago. It was actually music that I had on Chaotic Radio, which I was host for at bzoo.org. So that's music you'll hear in the background for Burn It In. Once I was at a beach off the west coast of Florida. It was New Year's Eve, and the yellow moon hung over the gulf like a swaying lantern. And I was watching the waves crash in front of me with a friend, and the wind picked up, and my friend just stared at that scene for a while. And then he closed his eyes. I, I asked him what he was thinking. He said, I wanted to look at this scene and burn it in my brain, re record it in my mind so that I could just call it up when I want to, so I could have it with me always. I do have my recorders. I burn these things into my brain. I write these things onto pages. I pick and choose what needs to be said, what needs to be remembered. Every year, at the end of every year, I would write in a journal, recall the things that were happening to me, and think of all the memories that I wanted to keep. And that was how I recorded things. That is what kept me sane. That is what kept me alive. When I was younger, I was starting to become a computer science engineer because I wanted to make a lot of money. I wanted to beat everyone else, but I hated what I was doing. And I just thought about all the kids who were in clicks so that others could do the thinking for them. Because burned into my brain were the evenings of the high school dances that I never went to. Because burned into my brain were the people that I knew I was better than, who thought that they were better than me. So, yeah, I wanted to make a lot of money. I wanted to beat everyone else. But I hated what I was doing. I hated what I saw around me. I hated the pain that people put each other through. And all these memories coming kept flooding me. So, to keep me sane, to keep me alive, I wrote down the things I could not say. What did you think I was doing when I was stuffing handwritten notes into my pockets? I mean, when I saw friends raping my friends, I wrote. I burned into these nightmares with a pen, and yeah, I have this all recorded. So yeah, what did you think I was doing when I was stuffing handwritten notes in my pockets or typing long hours in the night? <laughs> You know, in my spare time, I wouldn't go to the movies and watch other people's stories. I'd sit at the corner of a cafe scribbling into a notebook, or I'd be at a computer lab slamming my fingers, my hands against keyboards, because there were too many atrocities in the world and too many injustices that I had witnessed, too many people who had wronged me, and I had a lot of work to do. There had to be a record of what you had done. Uh, did you think your crimes would go unpunished? And did you think that you could come back years later, slap me on the back with a friendly hello, and think that I wouldn't remember? Now, you see, that's what I have my poems for, so there will always be a record of what you had done. Yeah, I have defiled many pages. In your honor, you who swung your battle axe high above your head and thought that no one would remember in the end. Well, I made a point to remember. Yes, I have defiled many pages. And have you defiled many women? You, the man who rapes my friends? You, who rapes my sisters? You, who rapes me? Is that what makes you a strong man? <laughs> do you want to know why I do the things I do? I, I had to record these things. That is what kept me together. When people were dying, that is what kept me together. When I saw my friends going off to war, that is what kept me together. And when I saw my friends being raped and left for dead, that is what kept me together. <laughs> and when no one bothered to notice this, or change this, or care about this, these recordings kept me together. I need to record these things to remind myself of where I came from. I need to record these things to remind myself that there are things to value and things to hate. I need to record these things to remind myself that there are things worth fighting for, worth dying for. I need to record these things to remind myself that I am alive. 